Well, today is the day. After a lot of planning and testing, the Exact Apply sprayer is uh, finally at our store, and we're gonna give it a shot and see if we can uh, make this project turn out the way that we envision in our minds. So today we're gonna be testing some of our prescriptions, and then hopefully later this evening, once it gets dark, we will run it for real and see what happens. So we had this idea a while ago to try and do something with the exact apply sprayer. I think the exact apply sprayer is an amazing piece of technology and I always thought it'd be really cool to time a John Deere sprayer to something like a song. So um, John and myself started uh, kind of working on the idea and um, so I, I kind of came up with a concept of, of a song and how we would actually program it to run in the sprayer. And John, you're the one that made the prescription. Yeah, so Nate was able to provide me with a image of what he had perceived that the um, layout would look like for what we would run the sprayer over. And I was able to use my computer and geo-reference that image he had created to a previous pass that a grower of mine had made took that image and all I did was overlay hand-drawn images on top of that as a prescription, send that off to a display, and the rest is kind of just magic on John Deere's part. All right, this is the moment of truth. We're at our field and we're gonna see if we can see the water spraying out of the nozzle body is like we think it should according to the prescription. Well, it looks like it's working. It's really hard to tell for sure until uh, we run it at night, but you can see the water going and some of the patterns that we set up. Oh yeah, that's awesome. Yeah. Yeah, so we're pretty much using like, all of the John Deere features, I think, that's really built into the sprayer. So one is individual nozzle control. And then obviously a lot with the, the display and, and JD Link being able to send files and, mm -hmm. and have everything show up on the display. You know, I can't really think of too many situations where a grower would be spraying as small sections as we're doing. Yes, because some of our sections are three feet in width uh, and about two and a half feet in length. So not many times in a row crop field that you're gonna see a zone such as that. But I think it, it proves that the system can do it, which is, which is pretty impressive. Yes. yes, part of the power of this system is being able to turn on and off on demand rather than having a 10 foot distance where you may be over spraying. And this video and prescription proves that in practice. Look at that, one at a time. That's so beautiful. Riding in the cab of the new 612R John Deere sprayer with a 1200 gallon tank and 120 foot booms. Going along at a steady 3.6 miles an hour. Reason being, if you look at the prescription that I'm running, we've got some pretty tight two foot, three foot wide zones. Um, hopefully you've seen the video that is the finished product of this, but I wanna show you Here's our booms going on and off. Here's what our prescription looks like currently. The beeping for the work being done is quite entertaining. We're about to get to probably the most interesting part of this whole deal. You can see our booms going off, one at, our, our nozzles going off one at a time. There's the drone again, and we're at the end. I will catch you on the next video. So our project was a success. We were able to get the sprayer to time to music, which was a, a pretty big project and one that we're pretty happy with. Yeah, when you first came to me, Nate, with this crazy idea, I didn't know if we were gonna be able to make it happen. I knew the hardware was, the hardware was there, the software was there in theory, but when you look at a real field application, something like this is probably never going to happen. Mm -hmm. And so it was an interesting case for us to test um, a great proof of concept that we were able to pull it off and 
What's interesting to note too is that this isn't something that a very select group of people can do. I mean, we've got precision ag specialists at each of our location along with sprayer specialists as well that would easily be able to pull off the same type of project. There's a lot of knowledge within our dealership mm -hmm. and that comes out of our E3 program, which is a lot of service both on the mechanical and on the precision side of things within the dealership. Yep. So to wrap up, if you're interested in learning more about the John Deere sprayers or Hagee sprayers for that matter, who which can also be equipped with exact apply technology, and you're interested in more sprayer technology, there's there's a lot of options out there aside from just uh, exact apply. So we can really provide the whole gamut. So if you're interested in learning more, you can visit our website. You can also visit John Deere's website. Um, and of course, follow and subscribe to Platte Valley here on YouTube, but also in all of our other social channels as well. We're, we have some other cool projects up our sleeves, so uh, hopefully in the next uh, few months we'll have some more cool things to, to release, so you'll definitely don't want to miss that. Yep, it's going to be exciting.